It always amazes me that no matter how covered in snow and ice a municipality is, when I get to the thruway, or I-87, the road is surprisingly clear. Prior to a storm event, we'll put liquid salt, brine, and beet juice, the mixture, down directly on the road as a liquid application. And it acts to jumpstart the salt in the melting process. Two, it acts to reduce the bounce and the scatter of the salt as it comes out of the spinner. It hits the road. Michael Luftus is acting director for the Albany Division of the New York State Thruway Authority. He says they've been using a special beet brine mixture to pre-treat and de-ice the roads for three years now. It makes the salt brine more effective at lower temperatures than salt brine alone. The magic mixture is 80% traditional brine, or salt water, and 20% beet juice. But these aren't the beets you're thinking of. The juice is actually an organic extract from the white, not red, sugar beet. Beets traditionally grown and harvested for their sugar create a liquid extract that's now patented and solely distributed under the name Ice Bite by a company called Road Solutions. Jay Wallerstein, the company's vice president of sales and marketing, says the extracted liquid is actually brown in color. When added to brine, it breaks the bond between snow ice and the pavement, making removal easier. He likens it to the difference between cooking your eggs in a Teflon or iron skillet. You would have a real mess trying to clean that old metal skillet at the end. But if you were making them in a Teflon coated pan, it would, you know, you'd probably be able to slide the eggs right out. That's what Ice Bite does when it ends up on the road. It puts a, an invisible coating of anti-icing solids on the road. The beet treatment will stick to the road as long as four days after spreading, lessening the need for further applications and saving the throwaway money. Sugar beets. Who knew? In Albany, I'm Jenna Flanagan for the Innovation Trail.